start slash turn off your iPhone 10. As you guys know, I just recently got this phone on November 30th. It is not the same as the iPhone 7. Apple did switch it up this year, so the process is different. However, it is still very simple to do. Having said that, let's get right into it. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna click the volume up button, volume down, and then hold the sleep slash wake button or power button right here on the right side. So we're gonna do one click volume up, one click volume down, and then hold the power button. So we're gonna go ahead and do that now and I'll show you guys how that looks. So one press up, one press down, and then hold the power button and then it will go ahead and force restart your phone. Just give it a second, it does take a little while. Like so, once it goes black screen, uh, it'll automatically show up the Apple logo. Just give it a second and it will restart like so. So that's pretty much it. If for some reason you come across this video and you have the iPhone 7 uh, or iPhone 7 Plus, it is very simple to do this as, as well. All you have to do is hold the power button and the volume down button. You're going to want to press both of these at the same time and hold them down and then it is going to force restart as well like so. So there's that. And if you have any other device that's older than uh, both of these phones, all you're going to have to do to force restart is hold the power button and the home button at the same time and it'll go ahead and force restart. This is very useful if your phone has been frozen or something similar like that occurs where you need to force restart your phone. I do not recommend doing this all the time to power it off. There really is no reason to do that. But that's pretty much about it. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe.